parents and relatives of kidnapped students of the Federal College of Forestry Mechanization, AFACA, Kaduna State marched to the National Assembly asking parliamentarians to intervene in this situation. They are worried as kidnapped students from other states regain freedom through the intervention of government, but the case is different with Kaduna State. They kidnap for Kaduna, they carry the children out. They kidnap for Azaria, they, kid, they carry it out. Why this Kaduna copy different? To carry us to meeting here, committee here, this year, that is why you come today. I beg. I beg, I tell God, beg you now. Help us, help us to bring our children. To bring our children. I beg, see them, see them. I just didn't see my boy, I don't see talk to my boy. I just didn't fast, I don't see fast with my boy. Why? If you know this issue, and the same power that to chop. Because my father to school. Nobody. He finally, the mother don't pay. And I never heard of government school fees. Some members of civil society and the student union who joined in the protest expressed concern over the increasing case of kidnapping across institutions in the country. We must not live through the nightmare of hearing that these children have died in captivity. May it never happen to any one of us. And may it not happen to those green fifties who have been given to this deadline. Do you know that when all of this is done, when all of this is done, what it will cost Nigeria, Kaduna State, what it will cost the parents, will be more than what it would have cost if they had taken care of the school properly. Mm -hmm. Our coming here would not have been uh, important or necessary if the government of Kaduna State, the provost of uh, Federal College of Forestry where this incident took place, uh, and the Director General Forestry Research Institute, and the ministry that supervised this institute, the Ministry of Environment, if they have taken the proper step to rescue the students and children of Federal College of Forestry Mechanization, AFACA, on time, we wouldn't have had any reason to be here. It is exactly 55 days of the students being in captivity. Emmanuel Onu, News 24 International.